While the final numbers are still being tabulated, in about 30 ridings, we came within 2,000 votes of the Liberals. We are building towards victory next time. I am disappointed that we've lost some members, and I've already initiated a post-election review to examine what went right, what went wrong, and what we can do better to win in 18 months. Justin Trudeau said just two weeks ago that if he didn't get the majority he wanted, he would trigger another election in 18 months. I've already taken the steps to ensure the Conservative Party both learns from last night and builds towards Justin Trudeau's defeat. We're all disappointed by the results and as leader, no one more than me. I'm in the process of trying to make sure we're reaching out to more and more Canadians. And in some parts of the country, we did that for the first time in a decade, having representation in Newfoundland and Labrador. In other areas, we fell short where we needed to be. And I'm disappointed because in a pandemic election where there's uncertainty about a future, I think we deserve better than Mr. Trudeau, who put his own interests ahead of the well-being of the country. But we have to acknowledge we have more work to do, and I'm going to work extremely hard with our team to win that trust to make sure we can see a Conservative government getting this country back on track in an election that Mr. Trudeau's already threatened could be 18 months away.